according to Forbes, um, businesses have realised that it is creativity which makes their brand stand out um, from the crowd. And especially with attention spans shortening and also with recession looming. Hi, I'm Larry Anderson from Embrace Change Projects. We help executives with responsibility for realizing the benefits of digital transformation, outsourcing and insourcing to effectively manage the people side of change. So I wanted to start a series called Creator of the Week. And that is really in response to the fact that really in 2011, back in 2011, according to Forbes, um, businesses have realized that it is creativity which makes their brand stand out um, from the crowd. And especially with attention spans shortening and also with recession looming. So what is creativity? According to Encyclopedia Britannica, the uh, definition of creativity is a richness of ideas and originality of thinking. So more recently in at a conference, uh, Paul Davis, who is head of consumer marketing at Microsoft, stated that he believes there will be a resurgence of creativity in the face of uh, pressure from automation. And it, it, it's also predicted that creative roles are the ones set to um, to be the sorts of jobs that are safe from automation, which I suspect may be partially proven wrong, according to what I've seen recently. But um, nonetheless, we still need to figure out how organisations can utilise creative and talent content uh, for their um, competitiveness. So again, according to Forbes, the only way to build a strong company and brand is by winning the attention of your target audience. But everybody is time starved and um, you know your attention will only be captured by items that they care about. So that also means that corporations and executives need to be great at storytelling. Therefore, um, I think creativity is central to that skill set. So to survive and thrive um, and be able to deliver change effectively, every organisation is now a media organisation. And in terms of content creation and distribution. So typically, however, in the past, what's happened is that um, this has caused an issue because it's these are non-core activities and non-core activities typically get outsourced. However, brands such as Unilever, Starbucks and BMW have already set up in-house production capabilities. So I think this is a perfect opportunity to really start to um, capitalise on the opportunity for outsourced media operations and creative creative operations. So we should always be on the lookout for the newest creative talent to help build brands and tell stories effectively and drive change. That's the reason why I wanted to start a, um, a series called Creator of the Week. Hopefully we'll find some really talented people that are out there and um, they can utilize their skills to help um, organizations be much more effective in what they're doing as a in-house media organization. Enjoy.